Oh, yo! Yeah, it's snowing, bruh. Good, you guys welcome back to another video y'all we're on a little vacation mm -hmm. Millie gonna let you guys know where we're at <laughs> <laughs> he thinks I'm um, y'all in today's video we're gonna be reviewing the Tanaya Lodge Resort at Yosemite let's get right into the video we're gonna show you guys the room and then we'll head outside I'm excited yes I'm excited all right, guys, so let's talk about the check-in part. So checking in was pretty smooth. There's no wait. There's a valet area where you check in with your truck, with your car, they pick up your luggage. The bellboy brings you in, shows you to your room, shows you the amenities in the room. He brought up ice for us. It was just a really good experience. I give that a 10. So I'm gonna show you guys the closet first. It's a pretty decent size. It has hangers and all that good stuff. You can rest your luggage in the little resting area, but there's no lighting in here. So it kind of sucks with that. So this is the other side. They have an iron and ironing board. Moving on to the restroom. Pretty big, spacious. So the vanity only has one sink. Um, it has little toiletries here that you can use. The only downfall in the bathroom, I don't like like it has the coffee machine inside the bathroom and the fridge. They didn't have space, space in the room, but I've never really seen that in rooms before. It has like a little area we usually just to keep things away. We put hopes things on that side and our personal stuff. And this is a makeup mirror. It has a lighting. That's good because the lighting in the room is not that great either. So the bathroom or the toilet area and the shower, you can divide it. Somebody's doing their makeup and the other person is throwing a bomb. You know what I mean? You can kind of give them space. This is the shower. It's a bathtub. It's a decent size. So let's move on to the room. They have a long mirror. So if you want to dress and check yourself out before you go out the door, you can do so. On this side, I have another luggage rest area. A hanger. You can probably use this for your coats and jackets, but I'm using it for my bag. It comes with a Frenchie if you want it. It's free of charge. All she does is sleep and eat. And poop. This is a bed. It's a king size bed. <laughs> I slept like a queen yesterday. We have a flat screen TV. It looks like it's about a 40 inch. A little outdated, but yeah. it does the job. Table, dining table. If you want to do your work, you can. And actually, guys, every time we travel, it's our honeymoon. So we get special treatment. So we got our champagne and a little dessert here. So that's the pro tip, y'all. When traveling, it's always your honeymoon. It's always your honeymoon. You get special treats, free upgrades. Uh, you have a lounging chair here. And that's pretty much it for the room. My say on the room is like the carpet could be upgraded. I'm thinking they're making it like more of a warm type of feeling, like a cabin feel. But yeah, it's kind of like it's, a it, cabin It's feel. cabin slash hotel feel. I would do it different where I'd lighten things up, make it more bright, but that's just me. Yeah, I guess the cabin feel is like kind of dark, but we do have a patio and the reason we have a room like this is because we have hope. So they're a dog friendly resort. The pet has to be under 50 pounds and a charge of $100. And they actually gave Hope a little goodie. They gave her like snacks and they gave her a little bed. They gave her a doggy bowl. So that was pretty cool. So I'm gonna give the room a four out of five just because of what we paid for it. I think it should have a little bit more amenities, but the customer service was excellent. We have no issues with that. The room is super clean and spec. One thing that we do is check the pillows and the beds before we lay down in any bed, just because we had a bad experience before. I'll give it a three out of five. You give it a three out of five? Yeah. Why? Just because of the whole situation with the bathroom and the kitchen being in there. Okay. And just, you know, I think it needs some upgrades. But other than that, like you said, customer service, everything was great so far. So next, we're going to show you guys the outside. So stay tuned for that. Come this way, Hope. All right, guys, man, so this is what we came for. As y'all can see, man, there's snow everywhere. My face was lit up when I saw this. So we're trying to catch the last of, you know, the season with the snow. We hope to see some snowfall today, maybe. They said there's a slight chance. So anyways, we're gonna bring you guys up, man, just show you what it looks like. So what it looks like when you enter, we're gonna take you guys up to the lobby and registration, which was uh, a great experience. Let's go. As we're walking into the lobby area on the right side, there is a, a kid zone. It's like an obstacle course snowed in and I think they're like shoveling it out right now. That's cool. They got a little kid zone, a little activity over there. In the 
past like two, three weeks it had three snowstorms, so it snowed like crazy. We wanted to be here for that, but we were kind of scared to drive through the snow. That's why we waited for better weather so we can actually enjoy the outside. Look at that. So one thing I would say, I mean, there's a lot of parking here, it looks like. Yeah. So parking is free because we're in the mountains. It's free. All right, guys, so right here, we're standing right in front of the valet area. This is where you check in your car and you have the luggage guy that comes and picks up your luggage and brings it into your room. They even have a fireplace right in front of us so you can keep warm if it's cool. I don't know, I think it's nice and cozy. Before we can show you guys inside where the reception area is and the activities on the inside, we got uh, we saw on the weather channel that it may be snowing, so okay, it may know. snow like around six or seven o'clock. We're excited. So I'm pretty We're excited nervous. about that, yo. <laughs> yeah, you can see like the overcast coming in. It changed up because it was supposed to be sunny all day. So, anyways, uh, yo, I think I just saw a flurry. You Did see you that? Really? Oh, I think I saw one too. That was gonna try to get the drone up, but I don't know. I think you can get it off real quick. It's not that before it gets windy. Cause yeah. It's starting to get windy. So that is the plan, y'all. So real quick over here they have the pool which is covered obviously because all this damn snow jacuzzi but they do have an indoor pool they do have an indoor pool and jacuzzi so that's cool too bad we didn't bring our bathing suits yeah we didn't plan on that but i believe in summer they have a lot of activities they even have arching is it archery 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 you can do archery in the summer and in the winter which is pretty cool they have an ice skating ring inside the resort yeah which we may is do cool. that yeah we may go ice skating yoga classes a sauna a spa sauna, spa they have like a lot of oh they have like a, a flashlight night hiking tour which i believe you can do in summer and winter which is kind of cool but if you come in the winter you better bundle up this is so beautiful man i've always wanted to see snow like this so they have snowshoes and bike rentals i believe in the summer the snowshoes obviously are for the winter when it's snowing walking in the snow Right now we're going to be walking to the reception area where you do your checking. They also have a nice lounge area where you can drink your nice warm coffee or hot chocolate. It's so pretty. Look, it's huge. You can come, read a book, and just lounge. So the reception area, it's on that area. It's nice and pretty. Then you have here the restaurant and they have Ooh. a coffee shop, deli shop. Fireplace everywhere. This is what you need in these kind of temperatures. All right, so they have the general store. And right across you have the concierge. So if you wanna plan any activities, you can go ahead and do so. All right guys, so we are on our way to have some dinner. We decided we're gonna do the nightlife hike with flashlights so we'll tell you guys how that goes that's at seven so we're having an early dinner and then we're going to do the hike in the freezing cold hopefully it doesn't rain hopefully it does rain so it snows <laughs> well they said it's they cold like enough that it's gonna be um it could be snowing so we'll see No way. 
y'all. It's snowing, bruh. Oh, yo. I'm out in the snow. Bumbaras! It's legit snowing. We are in Yosemite and it's snowing, bro. I'm like, let's go home. I'm ready to go home. I was just wanting to see snow. I can't believe it. You feel better now? Yes, yo. What? Crazy. <laughs> I'm cold. Bye. We've decided we're not gonna do the tour because we spoke to another another guest that did it last night and they said it's a beautiful hike, but we need proper boots. And we didn't bring boots. We not just gonna work. So it's not gonna work. We're just gonna enjoy the room. Oh, we're back. Where are you? Yo, yeah. Hope, are you yeah. alive? <laughs> Hope. You alive? Yeah. Why are you doing that? Babe, it's snowing like crazy. Why are you doing that, girl? Yeah. Hope, look at this snow. Bro. Babe, look. Mira este jibaro. But you, I told you, you're gonna hurt your back. Babe, you sure you didn't hurt yourself? Yeah, but how do you people dive in it? Babe, when it's soft, when it just falls, it's been here for a while. So why'd you let me do that? I told you not to do that. <laughs> you said, why I let you do that? You're Ow. stupid. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap up this video right here for the day. Um, it was a nice little chill day in the resort. I mean, I saw a snowman. I was super excited about that. Mm -hmm. like, I've never seen snow falling. Yeah, that made, my, like that made my trip. That made my trip. <laughs> the resort was, I'd give it probably like a three out of five. The service was real good throughout the entire stay. We leave tomorrow. I don't really expect a lot of activities going on because of the snow, everything is snowed in. But um, that's just my thought. What do you think about it, Ben? Like, give it a strong four. Just four. because uh, the place was very clean. I have nothing, to, nothing wrong to say about that. The resort was clean, the room was clean, everything was very detailed. Some of the pictures in the room were a little outdated. The walls are very thin. You can actually hear the people on the second floor walking, and I believe we have kids up there. And if you're a light sleeper, that would be something that would be really annoying. They have earplugs on your nightstands. So I'm guessing they're aware of the problem. I would say that some of the activities here, I think they should include a little bit more inside of activities, inside of the resort. And the 90 rate, it's not very cheap. The premium room is It's a premium room. room, it's yeah. pretty basic. $200 a night for the premium room. And then you, our dog is crazy. I'll Star. come back with you. We'll, oh yeah. yeah. I'll come back. If you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Turn on your post notification bell so that you can see every time we post a video. Follow us on social media. Links will be in the description below and we'll see y'all in the next video.